A storm was brewing tonight. Storms are brewing. Cute. Very cute. Though the drizzle outside Key Arena didn't cloud performance on the court. Uh-huh. It's what brought eight-year-old Kennedy. Yes, being able to be here is really awesome, and getting to see the storms is awesome also, and I love them so very much. Ready to enjoy the game and meet some personal heroes. Trying to get autographs. But she's looking for one in particular. Mm, at least two birds. That feeling. A lot of heroes out there on the court for these young ladies, yes. Spans generations. And us old ones. <laughs> <laughs> so exciting. Finding inspiration in the storm seems to be universal. I was a Girl Scout forever. Bethany Riles is a retired PE teacher. Nothing like today, and we don't really know how good women can get. I mean, they're still getting better every generation. Well, I think it makes men stronger too. You know, I mean, when you have strong women, you have stronger men. I mean, you know, there's always been a strong woman behind every great man, right? You know, come on, we know that. Yeah, I just felt really blessed and lucky to be here tonight. Just ask Aaron Jones. I was the guest chaplain today, so I got to do devotions and pray with the team today before the game. How was that? It was incredible. I tried out 20 years ago. So it was kind of awesome to come full circle. I've been following Seabird, actually came and spoke to my girls her first year. I'm, I was a teacher in Tacoma and she came down and spoke and said to be out here now to watch where she's come to is just pretty incredible. She says Bird inspires not just her students, but her too. She's awesome and I love that, you know, I'm almost 50 and I love that she's an older player and still going and still leading her team. So with the first win under their belts, Go Storm! many fans left feeling like this team's success is a win for them too. For little boys and little girls just to see strong women, just to see the commitment of excellence, you know, it's quite spectacular. And another takeaway from tonight, it felt like so many people had a story about a player, maybe Sue Bird coming to visit their class, their team, and having an impact on them. A lot more kids going to have an opportunity to get that experience tomorrow at a skills camp with players before game two on Sunday. Live at Key Arena, I'm Michael Crow, King 5 News.